you will find watch faces with 3, 4 or even 6 complication slots, but Bubble Cloud does not come with such a limit. We can add as many as we want and now there are even layout options. We have the classic Bubble Cloud style and now the standard Wear OS layout has also become available. The number of variations goes up to 6 when it comes to range type complications such as battery level and goal based data. For one we have Bubble Cloud's classic way to show progress via colors. The battery bubble for example gradually changes from green to red as the battery drains out. But the option of the standard Wear OS progress ring is also here. As well as using themable gauges now in various styles included in the one click themes. And it's also possible to reverse the color mapping, the bubble turning red at higher levels to warn for dangerous UV levels for example. We can even combine colors and rings. Add watch face complications from the settings. Add complication, complication bubble, select the provider. After picking the actual complication, we are taken to the bubble edit screen which we can otherwise get to by long pressing the bubbles. Here we can choose the bubbles location. We can place complications on our watch face marked by the star. We can also place them in the app drawer. It's called the archive cloud in bubble clouds. Or we can even create folders and place complications in them. With the plus minus, we can change the weight which controls the position of the bubble in the given cloud. We can toggle whether the complication shows in always on ambient mode or not. And this is where we can select the progress indicator type. If we choose the ring mode or the new gauge type indicator, we will also have the option to set the bubble color. Going back to the watch face, we can see the gauge style matches the rest of the watch face theme. If we pick a different theme, Lilac 12 from pack 8 for example, the gauge will also inherit the new style. As with any theme component, it's also possible to get just the gauge style from a different theme. Let's use the scale and pointer from theme Ulrich, both in active and ambient modes. See the difference before and after? These components are also recolored if we change the color tinting of the theme. I highlight the gauge parts together with the other components of AFRIC 12. As I change the color hue, the gauge pointer is also tinted to blue. Finally, the same options are available in the phone app. You can select the gauge components in the one-click theme dialog and modify the bubble layout and color when we tap to edit a complication bubble in the Wear Cloud Editor. I invite you to check out the new app website with hundreds of troubleshooting and feature highlight posts. Follow Bubble Cloud on Reddit, Twitter, Instagram or Facebook so you don't miss icon packs and one-click themes which you can get for free usually for a limited time only. I plan to make more helpful videos Make sure to like and subscribe to get notified. I would like to express my gratitude to all of you who reached out over email to report bugs or suggest new features such as the ones shown in this video. Your feedback makes the app better. If you like the app, you can balance out the negativity my app is constantly getting by leaving a 5 star rating in the Play Store. Thank you and enjoy the bubble clouds.